if you notice, I have a little bib on Jen Jen right now because I'm going to go ahead and dress her and I don't want the robots on YouTube to get confused. <laughs> I'm Yvonne and welcome to having you on. It's Theme Thursday announcement time, but before I get to this week's Theme Thursday announcement, I so want to share with you a goodie that I got and you're thinking, why didn't I share it with you before? And the reason is it didn't exist. I went over to Monica Splace's booth. Yeah, <laughs> I went over there with this fabric. I did. And I said, will you make a dress for me? And I gave her the size that I wanted. And she made this cute little dress. And I just love this fabric. This is the fabric I brought over to her. It's sort of a tulle type fabric and it has little pearls all over it. I just thought it was so unique and it reminded me something like a vintage type fabric and so she made this cute little dress as well as little pantaloonies to go with it and a little bonnet it's ever so sweet <laughs> and it also has the little pearls on it i ah, just thought it was sweet and so just wanted to share it with you it's time for theme thursday announcement to see jen jen coming right up I'm back with Jen Jen, and she's going to help out for Theme Thursday announcement. And it's a theme we haven't done in a long while. It is so do, and it's original to Theme Thursday, and it's lots of fun to do as well. And it's time for dogs and cats. Dogs and cats, and I have this cute little romper that is in lavender. It has a little playful kitten on it, and it's Carter, size six months. I do want to explain that Jen Jen she is the Leah sculpt and she was reborn and sculpted by Ping Lao and so she has on a belly plate that is sewn on her and it's really nice because you can tell it kind of gives her this uh, neck plate here you know the illusion of it and so I, I really like it but I don't want the robots to get confused on YouTube so we're going to do this just like this and there we go. There we go. See? There's, so there's no confusion. See? <laughs> little magic trick. So there we go. You can see her little belly button. Maybe. <laughs> and it's so cute. So easy to dress her in this. And I'm so glad too because she is about size uh, six months size. And she is very sturdy let's just put it that way <laughs> she's a little sturdy one oh she's so cute she had and dress her in this cute little romper but i do want to show that i have such cute accessories to go with this little romper as well are you ready to see i have these little socks that i have little, did you look at look at how she grabbed those right away little socks with little kitty cats on them as well as cute little shoes that have little kitty cats on them and I do have this little bow for little Jean Jean as well I have to hold her so she doesn't fall forward because she can't quite sit up on her own sometimes I mean she can but you know I, I gotta be nearby especially when she's on a changing table yeah <laughs> Well, come along with me. I have some more to share with you, as well as the alternative, which is coming up, your alternative choice to go along with this week's Theme Thursday. Here, Here we go. are my Sandy twins, Huey and Morgan. If you noticed last week, Morgan was missing from last week's Theme Thursday. <laughs> but she was here, and she was set for uh, joining in with the video, but... When I put her next to Huey with what she was wearing, the green that she was wearing clashed with what he was wearing and I couldn't share them together and I didn't know what to do. So I didn't get a chance to share Morgan last week and I wanted to make sure that I share them together this week. Just in case you were wondering, she's still here and she is set for this week's theme Thursday. I dressed her in this, um, I guess you could say it's vintage now <laughs> because it's been a few years, not quite I guess. Um, a Jimpery Shy Kitten Golden Books little dress and she has herself a little fluff kitten there and there is Huey and he is wearing somewhat vintage I believe it's 101 Dalmatian overalls it's just adorbs and I'm so excited to have him in my nursery now to have a reborn of this size because I have these 
uh, little outfits that I didn't have anybody to dress in. <laughs> that was the correct size, so I'm so glad to have him. Oh, and let me tell you, the alternative is coming up, and I will share that with you. Here we go. Here's my reborn toddler, Leanne, and of course I had to share her with a couple of alternative reborns, a kitty cat and a dog. <laughs> and she has a little kitty cat on her top. And Cole, the kitty right there, he has a little doggy on his onesie. I know it's not a cat, but it's a dog. <laughs> but look who else is here. Look who else, who's that? Don't lick the, don't lick the camera, don't, oh. It's a little strawberry <laughs> and he's going to help out or she, I'm not quite sure. <laughs> it's going to help out for the alternative theme announcement and that is pets. Pets is the alternative. Any animal that you would consider a pet can be anything that you desire. Look through your own Donnie wardrobe and see what you can find. Just in case you may not have dogs or cats on an outfit to dress your reborn for theme Thursday, perhaps you have the alternative, which is pets. And there's so many different kinds of pets. So go looking and get to share your reborn for theme Thursday. I so enjoy seeing your videos. Go well, come along with me. Here's sweet Asriel. In case you were missing him last week, here he is. And he's set for this week's theme Thursday. I so love this onesie. It's a little newbie, just like the ones that make the pacifiers and the bottles company and it's kind of unusual to have fine clothing line that they have I didn't know I've had this for a little while so I don't know if they still have I don't know <laughs> but I just thought it was so fun has such a silly little puppy on there and that I hope that you have lots of fun with this week's theme Thursday come along I have someone else for you to see here we go Here's sweet Abigail. She sat for this week's Teen Thursday. When I went to go looking through my dolly wardrobe, I came up on this top and I so wanted to share Abigail in it. <laughs> the little kitten with a crown. Abigail had to have a crown as well, but she also has little kitty cat socks. Sweet little Abigail, I hope that you enjoyed seeing her. Come along with me. I didn't want to pass up the opportunity of sharing Millie Rose with you, wearing this little romper with little playful kittens all over. I love it because it looks like a little vintage print, and I'm so looking forward to going to the Kansas Doll Show and sharing footage with you of the Reborns that are there. Of course, the goodies. I'm so looking forward to seeing all the goodies for Reborn. So, oh, it's so much fun, and I'm so looking forward to it. And I get to see some old friends and new friends there. And I look forward to sharing the footage with you that's coming up soon. Please subscribe so you don't miss <laughs> what's coming up. Oh, and what is coming up? Someone else is going up. Well, let me share them with you. Here we go. Here is Gaku. I so wanted to share them with you. Yep, there's another rhyme there for you. <laughs> and look through your own Dolly wardrobe for this week's theme Thursday. Either dogs or cats or the alternative of pets. It could be any kind of pets. You know, there's lots of different kinds of pets people have. And share your reborn for theme Thursday. I also want to share Penny with you, but I will share her on Instagram and Facebook. And if you're not following me there, you can follow me there. I get to share some more reborns there as well. <laughs> Do take care of yourself. Theme Thursday, bringing the community together one theme day at a time. That's all for now. The Reborn Feel Good Channel.